Hey guys, and welcome back to XCOM, Terra from the Deep. When we last left off, we were scouring the oceans and taking down loads of enemy uh, fighters, which was cool. So we are going to continue mopping up the last two that we shot down. Uh, look at our memorial. We've lost over half of all of our aquanauts. Damn. So... Uh, research we have none basically which uh, is worrying Barracuda's right Triton is refueling but it should have enough fuel to get out and do what we need uh, so if we go to equip submarine Triton we have some soldiers on board we also did we start manufacturing the new displacer we did we don't have it yet though um, so we've got a small lobster man escort and ooh, alien colony expansion so there is another uh load of alien assholes around now do we wait for the displacer to be ready or do we just say fuck it and go out um let's uh, Wounded for how long? 22 days. 23 days. 7 days. We actually have a lot of guys, to be honest, to take with us. So we might as well equip submarine, triton. Get some more crew on board. I mean, why not, right? I guess we could take some of the rookies, but... It doesn't matter too much. Geoscope. Right. Intercept. Triton 1. I know you're refueling, but go. Go for the longest one out first. We should be able to get both of these puppies if we are lucky. Alright. Now, what's everyone rocking? Because I don't... Oh. Don't really want that. Uh, clear inventory. Let's go for... Why are you lot carrying... Uh, right, create inv inventory template. Let's do that. There we go. And as long as we can afford to do it, that is what we shall do. Don't need stun weapons. Okay, so at least... Oh. It gets them as close as possible. Although, we do want two heavy-handed big boys. Nope. Can we not? Okay, so I guess you can't actually clear the inventory. Once you've already made a template, which is questionable. Okay. So let's load up on as many rounds as we can stack into this person. Ooh, nope. Don't want those. L uh, hopefully we'll never need to use chemical flares again. Unless we have to go into an alien base. Which, let's be honest, at the rate we're going, we will. Which, oh man. Really not looking forward to that. Now, where are we? Okay, so we're in the top corner. It's not terrible, you know. We're not in the top... Well, yeah, we are kind of in the top corner. Whoa! Oof! Oh! Contact. Hit in the back. No damage received in his weakest armor. Return in kind, my friend. Oof. Return in kind. Right, next man out of the boat. Silvo. I'm going to need you to make it happen. 49 TUs. You only have that. Come on. That was not what we were looking for, to be honest, um, my dude. Okay. Uh, right. Well, 55 TUs. Your aimed accuracy is actually really freaking impressive. But uh, actually, your snap's not bad either. Oh, come on, guys. Don't. Don't make it so we have to drop the hammer this early. 
Okay. I mean, I was wondering if we're going to get any casualties on these missions, because I was going to say, oh, these missions should be fairly easy. But then we come out of the boat and get our asses stomped. Two rounds he's taken. Two. 54. Go up. If you look in the right direction, that would help. 87%. Can't do it. But you can do a 60. Dude, come on. I'm going to have to drop the hammer on this guy. Oh, no. I threw it. Oh, dear. Why? Why? Why am I being so incompetent? Uh, you can see him, though. 49. Ooh. Good man. You may have just saved some casualties there. And I would say you're, it's highly likely that you've just saved some casualties there. Okay. Um, you need to go pick your... What did I throw? Oh, right. You just threw the round. Oof. I need to pay more attention. It's been so long since I've played this. Well, actually, it's been about a week. Give or take. So, everybody out. Everybody off the ground. Trouble is, everybody off the ground, although that's cool, uh, we are kind of clumped together, so if we get any shots coming in on us, we're going to have a bad time, because we're very clustered. Alright, everyone else, move up and get ready to exit the boat in the next mission. You, uh, sure. Ooh. That was lucky. Ooh, so is that. <sighs> okay. Where are you? There you are. Accuracy, 53. You can do it. Ooh, good hit. Good hit. Solid connection there. Okay. Can you get eyes on? You can. Can you give me 51? 69% accuracy. You have failed everybody in the history of humanity today. What about you? Good, solid hit. He's down, but he's not out. Okay, let's start fanning out. Slowly, slowly fan out. Ah, oh, what a dick penis, man. Seriously, have them behind you to start with. Ah, man. Right, okay. No point in worrying about that now. Let's get some dudes fanning out down here. I don't like the fact that, that guy's unconscious, but at least hopefully he'll be de-armed now, or disarmed. Alright, everybody fan out. Okay. That doesn't look too bad. Oh, God, he says, as he takes a plasma round square in the chest. Who was that? That was, ooh, Cherubin. Cherubin just took a round and shrugged it off. Like, is that all you fucking alien assholes have got? Bastards. Right, let's bring this sack of shit down. Oof. He's just taken two scorching loads of plasma in the face. And no shits given so far. Right, another contact splashed. Let's start fanning out. Come on. You can see one. Who can you see? You can see him. Good. Can you give me a 38? You can't quite give me a 38, but... Because you've shown us the way... Can you give us a 96? Ooh, good connection there, my friend. Good connection. We'll surely make you some aquaplastic medals or something in the coming months. Oh. Although we can't directly see them, we can still get rounds out. Okay. Start exploring. Guess nothing to see down here. Now, there shouldn't be too many contacts. 
in this place. And hopefully we've just shaken their morale pretty hard. Generally has that effect when they see all of their friends, you know, dying around them. Generally a good show. Gives the boys back at home something to celebrate. Right, okay. This one looks like it's almost intact as well. I'm guessing there's one more shitty little alien inside. We might have the Illyrium here, guys. If so, it's actually quite a lucky roll. In fact, I would say it's a very lucky roll if we've uh, managed to somehow shoot this bass down and keep the Illyrium. But I do have a sneaking suspicion there could be some down here as well, which would not be good at all. That would be a concern. I can't believe we've taken rounds in the face and lived to tell the tale. That's also pretty impressive. Whoa! And you, you tanked it as well. Have we got cheat mode on? Are we playing in god mode? Oh man, how did you miss? Aaron, I'm going to need you to make this happen, my friend. Oh no, right, this is going to be where it gets awkward. Because I very much doubt you're going to be lucky a second time. Keep the front armor towards the enemy. We could drop the hammer on this guy, but I really don't want to. If there's any chance of keeping this Illyrium. God damn. This is really unfortunate. Um, let's see if we can just push these guys forward. You can see him. If you can see him, does that mean you can shoot him? It does. Good, solid hit. Uh, we bruised him. Aaron? What can you do for me, buddy? What can you do for me? Not much, apparently. 44, 38. You can't, can't quite make it happen. Oh, man. I really don't want to shoot the Illyrium. We could... Finish this fucker off with a torp. I guess. If that's going to work, but. We need Illyrium. Okay. Okay. If he steps out, there's so many guys here. There should be some reaction fire. Oh my god, he got lucky. Oh man. Yeah, they're going to need to clean his uh, suit out after this. Oh. Yes, and we got the Zerbite. I, we needed that. We needed that. Talk about being up to your ass and your own shit. Okay. Yeah, that was okay. Five aliens killed. Iron beam accelerators, magnav, uh, aquaplastics. Not too bad. And of course, we got an absolute ass ton of uh, improvements. Which is good. I cannot believe that two or three of our guys tanked shots to the face uh, that's quite crazy and you can go straight back out again let's see if we can repeat this success I'm sure uh, we're like in the middle yeah this is going to be this is going to be a bit of a dirtier battle guys I don't like this. 
Ooh. Ooh. Accuracy. 84%. Really? Okay. I don't know what else I was expecting, to be honest. You can see him from inside the boat. Give me an aim shot. Really? Really? Good hit. Uh, 50. Right, so give me aimed. Good hit. Let's get someone else out. Let's get you back in. Let's get you back in. Let's get you out. Can you give me a good hit? Right, one contact splashed. You go hide. If we can bloody these guys. Oh, hey, friend. Oh, there's two of you again. Snap, 84%. Can you snap again? No. Good. Well, good takedown. I wouldn't say a good kill, but good takedown. Uh, can you? No. You're not going to fire from inside the sub. That's just a no-no. That is a definite no-no. Aim shot 40, so you might as well... Might as well do a guaranteed hit, I suppose. Or as guaranteed as XCOM will allow. You... 72% chance. Whoa. Come on. Come on. 88 or 88 is good. Right, we'll take it. We'll take it. Okay, we'll take it. Back in the boat. Oh man, I love having all these time units. This is so good. Right, cool. Okay. Any more? Oh, yes. Yes, there is. Hey, friend. Uh, interesting to see you just out having a bit of an explore. Back in the boat. Oh, sounds like it's over here. This is really good so far. But it only takes one fuck up to ruin the day. Alright, let's take another sit down and then we'll give it another turn. See if any more of these bastards are going to come out and introduce themselves to us. No, I think we're good. I think that's that. So, let's get everybody high. Not that kind of high. What the hell's the matter with you? So the combat situation. And let's see what we can see. All right. You get the feeling, yeah, it's all going to be coming from over here anyway. At least the majority of it. He's got the pulse cannon. All right. I kind of like having all these guys, actually. It is making me question to whether I want to invest in another tank. I prefer having the extra men. 
At least so far. I mean, the tank has its advantages, of course. There is no right or wrong way with XCOM, of course. Okay, let's get everyone to fan out. So, we have got damage here. So, there's going to be no ZR bite, sadly. But, that's okay. Make sure everyone's got enough to use to get a snapshot in. Definitely want everyone off the ground as well to eliminate the possibility of grenades. Not that grenades really do an awful lot to us with this sort of armor. Cool. All right. Um, what about you boys? You boys start moving in. Let's fan out as much as we can anyway. Okay, back of the map actually looks clear. I mean, this is XCOM. We never want to factor that out completely. If there's one black square, there could be an enemy. But let's hold on to our asses and see what happens. Hmm. Well, so far, it's all quiet. Too quiet. Yeah, he's in there. Oh, wow, we did a number on that ship. I mean, we could um, just pulse launch the ship to pieces, which is a favorite old tactic of mine. But I guess if we don't need to waste them, we won't. We're going to need a lot of those when we inevitably have to go back into an enemy ship, uh, enemy colony, because we're not getting our commander any other way. That much is now abundantly clear okay this side of the map doesn't look too bad either nothing here no okay yeah it's definitely I was just about to say it's definitely just like one turd left in there who's got eyes on come on Bring that son of a bitch down. Oh, right in his back. No. No, there's more. That ship is totaled. Nothing but scrap. Alright. Okay, let's get some guys closer to the ground. Just so they can get a little peek in that gaping wound in the side. Yeah, I like that. You gonna come out? Oh, there. Oh, there's. Oh, there's a couple of them. Damage report. No injuries at all. Woof. Snapshot 40. Oh, man. Man, you champion. No damage whatsoever. Nice. Let's try and move up a little bit. There is one more in there. We did see him. Um, uh, yeah. I want to kind of get you advancing. Or do I? I don't know. I don't <laughs> really don't want to get you killed. We need to get some dudes down and around. Just in case they come out the front. Get you boys down and around. Let's see if we can cut off the front. Although I don't think they're going to use the front. Because of the absolute chaos and damage we've caused. Oh. Oof. There he is. Not sure. Can you get a shot in on him? Not enough time units. Oh, you can. You can. And if you can, you will. So if we sit there, we can get a shot on the fucker. Unfortunately, with these rookies, 
definitely not a guaranteed hit. Far from it. But I guess we can put the pressure on. Um, yeah. Attempts to end task. Or end turn. Yeah, he's going out the front. I thought he fucking might. Little bastard. You little bastard. There's no point in hiding. Okay, let's get you there. Let's bring you back down for support. There's going to be no reaction fire, unfortunately. Uh, doors are shut again because we ended the turn. Which is unfortunate. Get you there. Okay, and... Yeah, he's going to hide. He's literally going to sit there somewhere and shit in his pants. Which is fine. He's well within his rights to do such a thing. But... Ah. Aim shot, 120% chance to hit. Yeah. Now, let's see if this actually misses, shall we? Nope, we splashed the target. Oh, we did get the ZR bite as well. Huh. What? That was way worth it, man. A hundred more ZR bite. Not quite as impressive uh, stat ups that time, but, you know, we, we, we did all right. We did all right. And once again, the night draws in. All right, let's see what we can sell. Uh, eight hours until that's done. Sell sack. And I have been playing... Uh, my missus brought me a Nintendo Switch yesterday. A Switch Lite. Because you obviously can't get the other ones. Like, for love nor money. I actually quite like the Switch Lite as well. I just wish it connected to a TV, goddammit. And, um... I've been having a blast with it. I've been playing the new Harvest Moon... Uh, not Harvest Moon. Um, Animal Crossing. And my god, guys. It's fantastic. So much fun. I really wish I could stream it or something, but when the other models come back in stock, we are going to put our pennies together and buy one. Alien clonings, we don't need. Alien learning arrays, we don't need. Alien reanimation zones, we don't need. Subconstruction, I'm pretty sure we don't need. Magnav, we do need, but we don't need that many. I think we need like two, maybe four. I can't remember now. Iron beam accelerators, we do need. Lobster men corpses, nope. We are going to keep some heavy thermic lances. Uh, don't need that thing. The Arbite, we're back up to a nice quantity now. Sonic oscillator. Sonic cannons. We do not need that many sonic cannons in reserve. Or any blaster rifles. Don't really need many of these in reserve either, but... Okay, so we just made like another 10 million. Well, 9.1 million. <laughs> so that's good. Um, we're in such an annoying place in this game. Like we are, for all intents and purposes, we are at the end of the game. The game is done. We just need a commander. And that is really where the game's fucked us with mind control. It's, there we go, okay, allocate manufacturing, new production, just go back to making particles, disturbance, the sensors, yes. Uh, just make millions of them, sell them. Yeah, the game's really screwed us over here. Very large, deep, fleet supply, Tazuth, center. Kill it. Come on. Come on. Oof. Right, where can we head you off from? It's going over there. Barracuda 4. Intercept course. Ooh. Yep. A very large... Dreadnought, center. Oh man. Uh, Manta 1. Uh, 
Dreadnoughts. This could be our chance. We need to take that down. Because they have commanders in. This might save us a shit ton of butt ache. It all depends how damaged our manta is. And to be honest, in the interest of... S I don't know whether to save scum this. I mean, we can always build another manta, I guess, if we have to. Oh. Come on. Come on. No. Mm. Select new target. Go on. Uh, last name position. No. Yes. Okay. Standard attack. Flying sub destroyed. Shit. I'm just going to reload that. I'm, gonna, I just, I'm wondering if there's any chance that we could actually get that thing. Or if our ship is just too badly damaged. Just out of pure curiosity. If we go for a cautious attack. Come on. Yep, I don't think... I don't think we can get it. That's a bit of a shame. Oh, that's so annoying. Return to base, return to base. Come on. Come on, go for it. Yep, there's no way. There's literally no way. Our manta is just too badly damaged. Oh, that's so annoying. Ah, oh, we had the keys to the kingdom right there, people. We had it. Uh. Yep. Now, if the mantle was on full health, we could definitely do that. Or, if we perhaps soften it up a little bit first. want that thing down. Right. So kill it. Get a few good hits in. Right. Get out of that. Disengage. Let's see if now that thing is technically softened up slightly. Select new target, very large, go for it. Oh. Right. I guess we've got no real chance on that dreadnought. Where the dreadnought's coming back. Right, you guys return to base. You guys return to base. How? Right, Manta repairs. Hmm. How much health does the Manta have? Damage 99%. 16 days. 13 hours to repair it. Oh, that's just nothing. We can't... 16 days to repair it? I mean, technically they've got to rebuild the thing. Oh, man. Anyway, guys. Uh, I'm going to have to end that video here. Um, 
Oh no. Talk about frustrations. Mm. Let's see, shall we? Large fleet supply cruiser. Well, we could probably bring that down. Maybe. Oh, that's... No, he's gone. <sighs> really disappoint... Ah. Another dreadnought. Or is it the same one? No. Return to base. Right, okay, guys. That kind of really sucked. We, we, uh, the Manta is cool, but the amount of bloody, um, repair time they take, holy crap. Ah, uh, that was so close. We def, I think that's the way to do it, guys. We need to take down a Dreadnought. I mean, we could go for another alien colony, but that's just going to be a fucking mess. Um, that last one. Right, there's two types of missions in this game that I don't enjoy. I don't enjoy the alien colony missions. I hate them. They're not fun. And I do not enjoy the um, ship terracites. They're also not fun. But apart from that, I do actually really like this game. I just wish... I wish there was a mod or something that you could do to change just how bullshitty... Uh, those two missions are because in my opinion that's what lets this game down over the previous uh, game the previous game was was perfect loved it the alien bases were cool the terracites were cool yaddy 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 but oh, this one they just notoriously tried to make the game as hard as they possibly could and they uh, absolutely succeeded so good on them i suppose anyway i'm gonna stop rambling now thank you very much for watching and as always till next time